Stop Watching Us is a movement to prohibit the inappropriate obtaining of private phone and internet records by government officials. On the StopWatching.us website, 596,215 signatures have been recorded in a letter to Congress expressing concern over the secret spying of internet and phone records by the NSA. The StopWatching.us movement has started with protests in 2013 due to the Snowden leaks and the reports published in The Guardian and The Washington Post expressing how the NSA has gained broad access to data and ability to track a person's movements and contacts over time. NSA snooping includes the interception and collection of call detail records and internet traffic. Including audio, video, photographs, documents, chat logs, and emails. Every American is at risk for getting caught up in the NSA dragnet. Including average citizens not suspected of a crime. Tools for surveillance have never been more powerful, and the threat to our civil liberties has never been greater. Edward Snowden was not the first. I represent six NSA whistleblowers who are being charged with espionage for telling the truth. The events after the release of the Snowden leaks brought to light the severity of the mass information being drawn from internet users and phone records. The violation of privacy directly led to the movement being called the Stop Watching Us campaign. This movement was created to describe and show the government how many people believe that their right to privacy is being infringed upon and what needs to happen in order for the public to be satisfied and feel safe. Does the NSA collect any type of data at all on millions or hundreds of millions of Americans? No, sir. Twitter and Facebook are being used by the Stop Watching Us movement to expand the awareness of the problems with surveillance by the government, as well as providing dates specifying certain rallies that have happened or are coming up, and links describing positive results from their campaign. We need to bring NSA activity from the shadows into the light of day. We need to end mass suspicionless surveillance.